Good morning to you, Chris. And Cindy, yes, it is a partial solar eclipse, not an eclipse of the heart, eclipse of the sun. And uh, it is partial, and I want to show you this is a different view, right? It's moody and dramatic. And yeah, I mean, it really depends where you are this morning, what you're seeing. Some people at the moment seeing that kind of looks like, I don't know. Dorothy's going to go fly in there in a minute, but uh, we've got partly cloudy skies right now in Central Park. It's currently 76 degrees, the relative humidity at 55%, and that is a significant decrease uh, from this time yesterday. So we're looking at temperatures uh, low 60s to the low 70s for most. So it is mild out the door for sure, but with the decreased humidity, I think it feels a lot more comfortable this morning than it did uh, this time yesterday. And as we look around the Northeast, uh, we're seeing similar conditions with cooler temperatures for some, but decreased humidity for all. The 24-hour temperature change uh, for Philadelphia, no change. For New York City, we're actually a little bit warmer. And then for Buffalo, 10 degrees cooler. Same for Portland, but it is the dew point difference that uh, is really the thing that you'll notice when you step out the door, that that decreased humidity feels a lot better. We were at 90 degrees on Tuesday and again yesterday, uh, so we actually had a four-day heat wave because obviously our 90-degree temps started uh, over the week. Weekend. So we're a little bit cooler today. At least that's what we're expecting. 82 degrees of forecast high. So still a little above normal, but only by about four degrees. And then tomorrow below normal. Same for your Saturday. So we are going to see a significant decrease in temperatures, even more than what we're seeing today. So your future cast as we turn this on. We continue to see some pretty significant clearing. We had a cold front come through, uh, and so we're really reaping the benefits of that. Mostly sunny and low 80s today with that decreased humidity should feel very nice. We're trending drier for tomorrow as well, so we may see a few more clouds, but it will be a dry Friday. Saturday gives us a chance for some shower activity, especially as we head into the afternoon, but it doesn't look like a washout. In fact, neither day does. So for Saturday, mostly sunny, 76, nice low humidity, slight chance of an afternoon shower you saw there on future. Cast and then for Sunday, uh, 77 degrees, a few more clouds, and a chance for rain. For today, really beautiful. We continue to see clearing throughout the morning. Uh, by this afternoon, mostly sunny, 82, so not as hot, not as humid. For tonight, we dip down to about 61 degrees, will be mostly clear. Uh, some of our distant suburbs north and west could see temperatures in the 60s, but take a look. Here's your seven day forecast. Temperatures will continue falling tomorrow and then sort of level out right around normal in the mid and upper 70s for the weekend. And with that, I'll send it back to you. Okay, Lisa, thank you.